Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to the volley, it is Hollywood Shono here with the Hollywood Shono in real life video for Tuesday, June 2nd, really late at night, but it's not June 3rd yet. And I want to thank everybody that donated, especially EI Brax dropping $70 today. More donations in the description below, but that is very awesome. And I'm very impressed with the turnout we had for Marvel Contest of Champions. I think we had about 50 viewers at one point, including over 30 on YouTube and like 17 or 18 on Twitch. And people were super excited when I was doing riffs. I had 34 riffs all together. And we had a little game between EI Brax and I where if myself or Stubbsy guessed the correct path, he would donate $5. Between the two of us and 34 riffs, we got nine of them right between the two of us. And 97 PR also got the featured five star right, meaning that he donated $60. And trust me, EI Brax, one day when I become famous, I'm taking care of you. There was others that I will be taking care of as well. But I'm very happy with that. The Star Wars Galaxy Hero stream definitely did well. We had over 20 viewers on YouTube. Twitch had between 8 and 15. So I think it's working. I think people are checking out the stream for the first time. We're getting new members daily, so I think that consistency is definitely key with my channel. And I don't expect myself to rival Arnold 101 or Mobile Gamer, but I just want to make a presence out there and give an alternate for when they do like 3 vs 3 Grand Arena or anything else. There'll be an up-and-coming YouTuber with different content that people want to tune into. And that's one of the things I loved about doing all 34 riffs is that it was something different from an arena grind, which a couple of people... We're wondering why I don't play Marvel Contest of Champions anymore. It's not that I'm bored with the game. I'm definitely not done with it. I needed a little bit of break. When you spend 12 to 15 hours a day grinding arena, it gets to you. It's like your whole life. And if you're not doing it, you know, as a full-time job making $100 a day or $50 a day, it ain't worth it. If I was making that kind of money, I would sit and do the arena grind. But we have to find other things out there that are enjoyable. Maybe even doing the uncollected monthly for a day might be a thing. We might do a couple more Marvel Contest of Champions streams on the main channel. This video obviously will be up before Wednesday morning at 12 midnight EST and other time zones. It's still considered Tuesday. Bottom line is it was recorded Tuesday, so I'm leaving it at Tuesday. Also, the Injustice Gods Among Us stream on my second channel, I don't think it went as well as planned. I still want to work on getting... Luchador Bane up to Elite 7. I do have 8 copies of them. I do need to finish Nightmare tomorrow. And tomorrow I plan on doing the Mortal Kombat Mobile Challenge. At least 2 difficulties. So look forward to that on the second channel. And afterwards, we'll probably do a little bit of Borderlands. As soon as this video goes live, I'll probably do Borderlands 2 on the second channel. And I want to do a little bit of something different. This is my backyard in the middle of the night you can't really see anything we have a light going on and some of you guys really love these outdoor streams i love them because it's something different we definitely need to do a grilling stream again in the very near future i think that was really well received as well and again let me know in the comments down below what you want to see from the channel don't tell me play injustice because you'll probably get banned as the light goes out I guess that means it's time to end things. There's the light back again. But yeah. A couple people mentioned Seven Deadly Sins. So if you want me to stream that kind of on an off night after my Star Wars Galaxy Heroes 12 to 4 stream, maybe we'll check that game out. A couple people also mentioned uh, Dragon Ball. We'll have to see. We'll give everything a shot if possible. I still need to get with uh, Brad Rollins possibly tomorrow, possibly Thursday. We'll do a WW2K19 stream. We'll make him. I also found out there were a bunch of mods within that game. Like, they made so many mods. If you look at Russell Gamia's video, it shows so many 2K19 mods. I actually want to check some of that out. But this vlog is going a little bit longer than planned. So let's turn the lights out, fade to black, and you all have a wonderful day.